So as we understand, we have two types of triggers, before triggers, after triggers. And in before triggers, execution will be before committing to the system. Before committing to the system. Okay, now in before triggers, in before triggers for new records, for new records, what type of how what type of data I will be having? I mean, old values, new values, old values, no, right? Because for a new record, there will be no old data, which is available in S object level, right? Okay, for a new records, for updating record old values new values here I will be having S and here also I will be having S ok now I have a question I have a question we will go here little bit if I click edit if I click, I will edit my account record. SEC U2. Okay. If I click edit, what is the world value of account name? Account number. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Right? If I click edit, and now I save. What is my world value and what is my new value? Yes. So, whether I modified or not modified, if I click edit, so if you click edit, system will consider that edit click, even value is changed or not changed, it will consider as a new data. Remember, okay? Even if you click, you didn't modify anything. You didn't modify anything. Now, system will understand, old value is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and also new value is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So entire edit layout, entire edit layout will consider as a new value all the way to the system. And the existing one is the old value. Whether you change or not change, it doesn't mean for the system. It always check. If it is clicked edit, it means the edit values are new values. Edit record is a new record transaction. And old one is a old record transaction. Clear? Yeah. So don't get confused, people are getting confused that I didn't modify anything so trigger will not supposed to consider as a new and old data. But actually if you click edit and save it means you have two values, old value and new value by default. Okay. System will consider the new and old values. irrespective of user modified field values inside the record or a subject record old values and new values will get assigned whenever user clicks edit and save button on a subject or any DML operation perform from any other cross reference objects. So what I mean to say, see there will be some transaction where this record will get updated through a DML operation using Apex classes, right? Even though if I say that update record 1, so the system will consider that update. In, it means that it takes an event of update call, it will generate a old record and it will also take as a new record parallelly. Okay? And minimum bear with my spelling mistakes. I can see there is a lot of grammatical gaps. Okay. 
now one thing is clear now one thing is clear what volt trigger dot new is which data type yeah how to get old values and new values new values to get new values what is the we have values trigger to new this is list type and also we have another way we have two types one is trigger dot new and another one is trigger dot new map okay trigger dot new and trigger dot new map old values trigger dot old and trigger dot old map clear clear okay now i will give you one template to write a triggers i will give you one basic template to start with the trigger so templating the trigger writing trigger trigger name on a subject even one even two even three okay if trigger dot is even trigger dot is even getting current record ids set why we need set what is the difference between set and list yeah set will not allow duplicates list will allow duplicates Bear with me. Let me complete this so that it would be easy for writing it. Trigger. It's a basic template. Anyone can follow, and it will applicable every time. Not only one time. It will applicable for every type, any type of triggers.
What is difference between update, upset and insert? Any idea? What is difference between update, upset and this one? Hello? External idea, let's forget about it. Upset is a combination of insert plus update. If the record already exists, it will do update. If the record is not there, it will do a insert. Okay. Now, I am passing this to Indu to you. I am handovering to you. Okay. I am just sharing this in a notepad and I will push through this one. Notepad. Just pushing this file in the here Dropbox. Take this file, okay, Indu? Okay, it is not dropping like this. Okay. 